everybody today we will we'll practice some advanced program in 8085 our question in our first uh, let our first question be we need to copy a, uh, we need to from we have a table one and we have table two and we have table three this is first source one this is source two and table three the, in the result of table three should be s1 minus s2 making and we should consider that this value in table 3, the destination table, should be positive. So we'll program about these, considering this section. And let us assume this start, this table start from 2050. This table start from 2060. And the destination is 2070H. So let's begin program. So now what we do is we load a, a register pair. Let us, in our case, we have HL pair with 2050 for first table for first table and D for second table and LXI B for two zero se address 2070 for destination destination we, we need to store S1 minus S2 considering the sign so what we do is we have we assume that we have 10 data we have 10 data HL ABCD right so let us move let us start loop one we consider in loop one we will now we our con the stack is sorry we used we have already used all the register available to us accumulator is something that we need using all the uh, the logical inst instructions these are only the register that we we the programmer can access through instruction code and these have already been used over here so we need to push a content of the register pair bc to in stack these push command will use push the the instruction or the sorry data to the stack and we can pop it out whenever we need we, whenever it is necessary so now we'll push that and we'll check ldaxd what it does is it loads an accumulator indirectly it is one byte instruction right so the content of an accumulator is Sorry, we copy that content over there. We don't need to mention this in our program. And now what we do is move the accumulator content to B, move the content of an accumul memory to accumulator, and we'll compare the B compare the value B with an accumulator. If we obtain a carry, then we we have to swap. We have to swap we have to swap because we need a positive data in a table and we need to swap so our swap case swap subtract case would be something like we need to interchange the position the content of accumulator to C and content of accumulated sorry content of B accum B to an accumulator sorry B to an accumulator and we subtract the value C from an accumulator so we'll swap we we'll, this function sorry this instruction this jump will carry, transfer the location to this otherwise we will subtract the value from B and now we will jump to another location with no ins no instructions or no condition so now what we do is at the end we'll jump after this we need to pop the value so we need to pop the value to B and STAX it stored the content of accumulator to BC now we need to increase the value of H that is our first table to 2051 similarly for our second table and similarly for our destination table also and then we need to compare as a, we use this as a counter for 10 and if this value we compare with immediate value of 5a if this is less than if we have no carry no carry then we loop to the first statement and after this the, our program is finished so let me just recall this program so what we do we have three tables we have three tables source table source one source two and destination table the content if this contain is source one and s1 s2 then we need a modulus value or a non-negative value in table three 
that is located at 2070. So first of all, we initialize the table L H table D table and B table. This is B table and loop one as we have only these pairs of register. So we use a push instruction. We use a push instruction to copy the content to the stack to copy the content to the stack so B register so we can use BC register pair so what we do we load an accumulator with the content of DE pair so the content of DE pair is loaded to accumulator now we transfer a data of an accumulator to B and from a memory that is memory means the memory at the data in present in HL register pointed by register pair to a accumulator now we compare the data if this is less than this if the data is less then we need we need to swap and subtract for a positive data so we need to swap and subtract we saw so we we perform that operation to swap in this section otherwise we'll subtract a number and we'll move to this uh, move to end section end section will pop out the value that we have pushed in the into the stack we have pushed into the stack will pop out the value and will proceed and will proceed we will load the accumulate the content of accumulator to bc will increase h d and b for the second table so that this becomes 2051 2052 for the next loop for the other iteration now as we know that we have 10 we have 10 we have assumed we have 10 data so we we have to check for a counter and if the counter is less than 5a we need to jump if there is no zero we need to jump to loop one else we here we end the program thank you for watching goodbye thank, don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more programming's video